Welcome Coyote fans, this is Paul Ferris. And as you can see, my seats are in. Um, probably going to do another version of the passenger bracket because it's just a little wobbly right now. And the driver's side uh, seat, as you can see, um, I can actually get in and out now and uh, sit comfortably. It's really, really tight. These are uh, not expensive. They're Cypher seats. I got them off of Amazon. Um, and they just match the interior and, and uh, grain of my stuff better than anything else that I looked at. And I actually bought a couple of other seats to compare and sit in them. So I chose these first, and uh, I just think they look great and they sit great. They're lighter. Um, and uh, this time when I did the bracket on the driver's side to modify it, I actually cut the carpeting so that the uh, frame member comes through. That's what you see there. I'm hoping to find a uh, wrecked 2000 Mustang GT or 2000 Mustang in general with that same uh, era of carpeting. Uh, I, I go to U Pullets a lot, and then I know there's a couple of them. If I can find that gray, I'll just buy some of it and wrap it around that post. Um, somebody actually sat in the back of my car this weekend and rode for just a few minutes and said, you know, this was this was okay. I, I would not want uh, someone without a really good seatbelt back here riding because this thing could kill you if you got in a wreck. Just your head head would hit it. Now, um, I'm thinking my grandkids might ride back here. Uh, I might put padding on this bar. Uh, my grandson is a lot shorter, smaller. He can climb in there. My granddaughter would have a seat that uh, protects her head that she wouldn't whip out of. <laughs> Uh, so that's where that is. Um, it was at the uh, car that used to be called car show that used to be called Car Craft this weekend. A lot of people uh, admired it. It was uh, one of two Coyote swap cars there. The other one was Matt Overbeek's car. Uh, the reason the console looks like it's loose is because it is. Uh, I have a double din head unit that I'm about to put in the car, Android based, and it has a reverse camera. And I'm looking forward to that. And one of the other things I'm going to mod is to put a uh, T56 v speed sensitive solenoid actor activator so I can actually shift into reverse without signaling via <laughs> pumping the handbrake, which is really annoying. Um, other than that, the uh, car is coming along pretty good. And uh, just giving you a walk around, and I will catch up with you on the web.